We made it. Alright, let's do it. Do what? More Dark Acolytes, it seems. You're gonna get fucked up. Damn. Good thing we weren't out there, that would've hurt. Yeah, who the man? The plan actually worked. And there's Musa for you. The soldiers from Shootern are all immortal. Hey, mice! Hey, it's good to see you again. Uh, I heard about your homeland. I figured you'd still be chasing women. What have you been up to? What? A blacksmith apprentice? Are you serious? You? Mice? <laughs> I don't believe it! You must Here's be where the Musa. fun comes in. I've heard a lot about you. I'm Sedina, Jabal's sister. It's nice to finally meet you. Uh... <laughs> huh? My... What's wrong, Musa? <laughs> Don't worry, Sodina. He's just shy around women. Are you sure you're all right, Musa? Oh, he'll be okay. He just completely locks up. <laughs> Anyways, um, what am I supposed to do here? Let's look around the place, see if we can find anything interesting. I'm worried about the neighboring countries. We can't get any accurate information about their situation. That's the world map there. What do you say? Anything? Nope, you're just silent. Because I think if there's something we're supposed to do around here while we wait on Musa to unfreeze, or maybe there's something we do that unfreezes Musa, I'm not exactly sure. We have achieved nothing by being defensive. A prolonged battle will only be to our disadvantage. Well then, prepare for the offensive. There's no place to have fun here. Guards just want to have fun, you know. Well, if that's not a reference to the song, I have no idea what is. Guards just want to have fun, guys. Um, where am I supposed to go? Um, maybe down here? This door? Nope, that's... Oh wait, that's downstairs, duh. This door, let's go here. Anything? More guards? Where do the Dark Acolytes come from? Those guys give me the creeps. They are a little creepy looking. They will only keep coming back. At least that's my opinion. Where? There's clock stuff. Oh, he's unfrozen now. There we go. Are you a spirit blacksmith? Will you fix my broken sword? Um... Sure, I guess. Sure, no problem. Here we go. Hmm, you sure are getting good at it, mice. But your sword still isn't good enough to withstand my strength. See? It cracked. You aren't as good as Java yet. Ha 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 ha, but you have potential. Keep up the training. It's always weird seeing laughter in text form. Because, like, I try and imitate it, and it's just not quite the same. Anyway, let's talk to you now. Man, I didn't think you were keeping up with your training. Mice, you will become a great spirit blacksmith. That's right, I will. Oh, not that it? Do I just do I just leave now? All right, I guess I just leave now. Let's go home while the dark acolytes are gone. I have a bad feeling about this. There's a little Star Wars reference thrown there too, it seems. 
Anyways, let's head on home. Okay, random dirt bath loading screen. Now which direction was home again? That way, I think. I don't cross the bridge. This is what I almost did last time. And I get no battle. Alright. Sweet. Any new enemies this time? Nope. Alright, and we're back. And... Gone again? Oh, no cutscene. As I say, that's a pretty quick uh, jump from battle to battle. Damn, he took out that Dark Acolyte pretty quick. Schmidt. I've never liked this game's name. It sounds like a, oh, this guy's name. It just sounds like a curse word. This is Schmidt, my brother's apprentice. He was traveling around the world. Sorina, who is this guy you're with? He couldn't possibly be your bodyguard. Well, fuck you too. Schmidt, you're back from your journey. He's learning how to forge good swords from Joppa. Thanks, Odina. Nice of you to say that. Good swords? Not by the looks of his. Well, fuck you too. Well, my sword may not be as strong as yours, Schmidt, but it glows. Glows? What the hell for? A sword must be strong enough to intimidate your enemies. Didn't you just see the awesome power of my sword? Where did you learn something like that? Jobble didn't teach you that. Let's talk later, Sadina. I'll see you in the smithy. Here, take this sword. Protect Sadina with it. Ha <laughs> Received Dark Sword. Mice equipped Dark Sword. And that right there tells you already that he is the bad guy. Or at least part of the bad guys. One of the bad guys. <laughs> the Dark Blacksmith. The Dark oh. Blacksmith himself. That moment you're about to read and he's already talking. Of course it would help if they didn't switch back and forth between voices and not. I never know what I'm supposed to read and what I'm supposed to wait for a voice to read for me. Hey there, what took you so long? I see you had a hard time fighting the weak monsters with your puny sword. Uh, actually, not really, no. You have a problem, Mice? I am the senior apprentice, you know. You should treat me accordingly. You've been gone for a year, dude. You don't count anymore. Schmidt, Mice, let me take a look at your swords. Here's mine. There's no need to look at my sword. It's obvious that mine is vastly superior. Again, fuck you too. Hmm. Are you surprised, Jabu? You've done excellent work, but my heart is overwhelmed when I hold this sword. A sword is a weapon, an instrument of destruction. It isn't that right? Don't tell me that my sword with its weak glow is better than mine. A sword's edge doesn't determine its quality. A sword reflects the soul of its maker. Without soul, it is impossible to master the secret art of the spirit blacksmith. Mice, I see that you're beginning to understand the feelings of the spirits. You've become old, Javo. What happened to you while I was gone? My pathetic sword is better than mine? You've got to be out of your mind. And I shall leave in a huff. Go to sleep, everybody. It's getting late. It's okay, Mice. Your sword reflects a pure heart. Don't worry about Schmidt. And the... Uh, oh, the heater just came on, so I apologize for that. 
Nice. Zzz, zzz. Father, it's not easy becoming a spirit blacksmith. The senior apprentice Schmidt is is mean to me. I don't like him. Zzz. Because that is how people snore. I gotta go. Where's the restroom? Huh? It's downstairs? No, dude, it's right there. Literally right there. Okay, well I guess you don't want to use the restroom. Downstairs it is then. I apologize for the air conditioner that has come on in the background. Can't really turn it off. What's this letter? It's not good to read someone else's letter. Uh, what's this letter? Let's just read it. Schmidt, I need to talk to you regarding that matter. It will be waiting in the outskirts of the town. It is the wish of my master. That, is, that sounds rather ominous. I have a bad feeling about this. There's that quote again. That matter, my master, gotta be about a woman. <laughs> yes, mice, it's gotta be about a woman, obviously. That man is glowing. Really? Me? We haven't much time left. Emperor Medius needs your power. Can you give me a little more time? This is what the Emperor desires. Oh, shit. Damn it, mice. Come on. <laughs> hey there. Nice evening, isn't it, Schmidt? Great night for a stroll. Out under the moon. In this specific spot outside of town. You can't deceive me like that. You overheard our conversation, didn't you? No, obviously not. I just told you I went for a stroll. No, you were too far away. It's none of your business. Don't tell anyone what happened here. What are you talking about? I went for a stroll. I just happened to see you out walking, looking at the moon. Nothing happened. Hey, Sedina, what's the secret to forging an elemental sword? The secret art of the spirit blacksmith? I'm not sure, but Chapel says it's being able to converse with the spirits. Ooh, shit. What just broke? What was that sound? Come on, mice. Why won't you teach me the secret art? You are not ready. I know I'm skilled enough to inherit the secret art. Schmidt? It is not for me or you to decide when you're ready. It is decided by your way with the spirit. Spirit, huh? Sounds like you're making excuses for not teaching me the secret art. Now I understand. If you won't teach me the secret, I'll find another way. Then go to Mist Valley and stand before the Mirror of Souls. It will reflect your true self. The secret is to imbue a spirit into the sword. In order to do so, you must know how the spirits see you. Mist Valley and the Mirror of Souls. The Mirror of Souls shows not only one's inner self, but also one's fate as a spirit blacksmith. If Schmidt realizes that, he'll become enraged and go on a rampage. Follow Schmidt if you're worried, mice. He went to the Mist Valley just east of here. I shall track him down. We shall hunt down Schmidt and stop him from doing whatever he's going to do, or I guess maybe let him look at the mirror and save the day and you know all of that stuff however we're going to do that in the next set of playthroughs or videos from your perspective because for now I'm gonna save and probably go to bed because it's 3 in the morning
Hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you for watching. Have a nice day. Bye.